Hello everybody. I hope everybody's having a great day. Today I'm going to do something which I got permission for. I stole somebody's idea. I asked if I could and this lady was amazing. I discovered her by pure chance. Her name is Candace Marie. I will try to remember to link her channel down uh, in, in the description box but she was essentially showing us what she had in her purse well for me i didn't care what she had in her purse i want her purse <laughs> her purse was absolutely gorgeous gorgeous you have to go see it i will try to remember to link it down below absolutely gorgeous it's like oh I want that purse. <laughs> Where do you live so I can go steal it? <laughs> oh, good grief. Thank you for coming back to one of my videos. Please leave me a comment, like this video, and subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell. Before I go into my purse, which has nothing compared to what she had in it, I wanted to mention there was a palette that I have that I was contemplating getting rid of. And when I say getting rid of, I mean handing it off to one of my girls. I have three of them. <laughs> so, and if they don't keep the makeup, they've got friends who can use the makeup. So nothing goes to waste except my money. <laughs> but I, I did my makeup with it today. And you know what? I like it. I actually like it. It is the Teddy Girl by Butter London and maybe it was just the the one shade that gave me a hassle but I like it I, I really really like it which is a good thing because <laughs> during the um, add-ons on BoxyCharm I ordered another palette just like this but uh, cool tones uh, I think they're more grays I can't remember exactly what colors they were but a different color <laughs> so it's a good thing I like this one okay so now that we've got Candace Marie out of the equation and Teddy Girl out of the equation how about we talk about Patricia Nash yeah. I love this purse oh she has a lot of different colors of this purse this is made in Italy it's oh <laughs> I love this purse and the best part about this purse well first it's got a pocket in the back this I've got nothing in here right now the only thing that goes in here is my phone and it's got just a little nub and this is magnetized closure I like the fact that it, it closes completely uh, and then you go inside and it's got pockets I don't like a purse with one pocket. They'll say, oh, you've got a pocket back here and the two little pockets. No, no, no. I want pockets. I want dividers. That's what I want, dividers. <laughs> so this is the mess of my purse. <laughs> okay, so let's go into the very front part, which is a lot of paperwork. Oh, <laughs> insurance, car insurance. Yeah, that's important. <laughs> and then what do I have here? I have... Uh, oh! <laughs> some little notes for makeup to take a, a, a look for at the drugstore. And um, yeah, no, I don't need those anymore because those are all on my no-buy lists. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. The things I wanted. Yep, yeah, uh, more. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> oh, and of course, bedelium tools. <laughs> okay, so I found some garbage. Shred. Definitely. I've got a shredder. It's fun. Don't look at my hair. It's. I washed it and that's what my hair is like now I had straight 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 hair before and now it's wave 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 and I don't know how to make the waves beautiful <sighs> okay so oh drugstore stuff red sorry 
<laughs> I can't show you that. <laughs> uh, this is a receipt for oh Canada Post. That was the duties I had to pay picking up bedelium tools. And this is my drugstore receipt for having picked up my medication. Okay, I have one mask with a filter and this mask needs to be washed. So filter out, <sighs> mask to be washed. Yeah, makeup. Mm, ick. And, ooh, backup Kleenex. It's actually clean. It's just scrumpled. I've got, oh, the uh, <laughs> compulsory reading glasses. <laughs> I absolutely need those. One bag. There's usually two in here. Ah, there's, there's the other one. There we go. Two shopping bags because... Everybody wants to charge you five and ten cents now. Seriously. Oh, what do I have in here? Oh, I have a mirror that is really useless. Now. I'm not going to show you. One, one side is uh, regular and the other side is magnet uh, uh, um, magnification. That's the word I'm looking for. But it's not like I wear lipstick out anymore and a mini nail file because my nails are constantly splitting and if I go out for more than a couple of hours and we're going to walk and I've got my emergency morphine there's none in it right now no there's none in it <laughs> but I put that in this is my emergency car key or what they classed as um, the valet key because what you can do is with your regular car key you can lock your trunk and this key will only work your motor so that the valet can park the car but cannot open the trunk that is a valet key but just in case it's always in my purse <laughs> let's see and on this side i'm going to show you this side as you can see i've got id cards bank card uh, da, da, da. I've got this one is a um, a protector RFID card and a Costco card. No, I do not have credit cards in here. They are out of my purse on purpose. <laughs> they are in. They are actually in my nightstand. Okay, in the back trash. I've got a backup mask with, I don't like the, these masks very much. I, I, I feel suffocated in them. So I've got these little, you, you put them on and your mask over and it gives you a gap. And it whether it works or not, psychologically it works a little bit. What can you do, right? Where you gotta wear a mask, you make do with what you have. And I've got a whole pile of other Kleenexes. Oh, okay. I had pills in here. <laughs> oh, that's when I went to a doctor's office and the appointment was at five o'clock. And I take my pills between five and 5.30. So after the appointment, I took my pills in the car when my husband was driving me back. And then the middle, I'm in the middle, and we have lady business. Because <laughs> yes, at 53, I still need lady business. <sighs> and still regular as clockwork. <laughs> Is that good or bad? And then my final little pocket, one band-aid. I don't, I, if I could, if my clothes had proper pockets, like men's clothes, I wouldn't use a purse. I find them inconvenient, always have. And I remember when my husband and I first started seeing each other, I would always put everything in, in my back pocket, my jeans or whatever. And he hated that because he liked to see my bump. <laughs> and anything in the pocket kind of ruined that look for him, so... 
I kind of got used to it. I, I like my husband liking my bum. <laughs> he still does. <laughs> and that's a good thing. So there we, I, I better put all this back because I'm going to forget. Knowing me, I am going to forget. And if I forget to have the mask in there, I can't go anywhere. So there we go. This is the purse that I have been using for the past six, seven months now. And I haven't bought a new purse in a long time. And usually what happens is I will buy a purse, use it for almost a, a year, and then buy another one and use it for almost a year. And a couple of times I will go back to an older purse. I have, I, I actually should count how many purses I have. But the thing also is I have some small little wallet size um, crossbody purses that I love to wear in the summertime. But with everything going on, I haven't been able to use them much. So I know I've got maybe eight of those. And I have a couple of other, I'm trying to see, they used to be hiding under here, but I've got them in a proper spot now not gathering dust and it's not here <laughs> but uh, i don't have that many purses I've, I've heard some women have 50 60 purses and i've also heard some women have less than 10. well i'm in between <laughs> how do you count the little wallet size crossbody purses is that a half <laughs> I might actually have 20 purses, uh, 20, 25 tops. I, I really should count that. It, maybe if I remember to count it before I post this, put it in my description box. But yeah, I have quite a few. It might be more than eight. I can't, I haven't looked in a while because I've been using this one and my memory is pretty much a sieve. So I should count my purses. Help. <laughs> So, give a shout out to Candace Marie. Let her know Bridget sent you. <laughs> and thank her for me for allowing me to use her name for doing this video. Because I had drawn a blank on doing videos. I don't know why. It just, and then all of a sudden, she said, and then ideas came out. Ideas just came out. So, I have a lot to thank her for. And, uh, See if she'll send me her purse. <laughs> Thank you once again. Leave me a comment. Like my video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. A bientôt.